The Freeway Phantom, a haunting tale of unsolved murders in the nation's capital. In the heart of the nation's capital, a series of chilling murders unfolded between 1971 and 1972, casting a dark shadow over the city of Washington, D.C. A serial killer, dubbed the Freeway Phantom, terrorized the community, abducting and brutally murdering six young black girls. The first victim, 13-year-old Stephanie Williams, vanished without a trace on April 25, 1971. Her body was discovered six days later, dumped near the Anacostia Freeway. A wave of fear swept through the city as the pattern continued. Each subsequent victim, ranging in age from 10 to 18, was found in a similar manner, their lives cut short by an unknown assailant. The victims, all black girls from Southeast D.C. shared a common thread, raising concerns about a targeted serial killer operating in their midst. The community, already facing social and economic disparities, felt particularly vulnerable to this unseen predator. A city gripped by fear and frustration, the city of Washington, D.C. was gripped by fear and frustration as the body count rose and the freeway phantom remained elusive. The Metropolitan Police Department, MPD, launched an intensive investigation, but leads were scarce and the killer continued to evade capture. The lack of arrests and the seemingly random nature of the killings fuel public anxiety and distrust of law enforcement. The African-American community, already grappling with social and economic challenges, felt particularly vulnerable to the unknown killer. A trail of unsolved mysteries and unanswered questions. Despite the MPD's efforts, the Freeway Phantom's identity remained a mystery. The killer's motive was unknown, and no clear pattern emerged beyond the victim's race and gender. The investigation was hampered by limited resources and a lack of sophisticated forensic techniques. At the time, DNA evidence, which has become a cornerstone of modern criminal investigations, did not exist in the early 1970s. An enduring quest for justice and the truth. The Freeway Phantom's reign of terror abruptly ended in September 1972, but the scars left on the city and the victims' families remain deep. The unsolved murders continue to haunt the community, and the quest for justice remains unfulfilled. In recent years, there have been renewed efforts to revisit the Freeway Phantom cases utilizing advancements in DNA technology and investigative techniques. A legacy of fear and the hope for resolution. The Freeway Phantom's legacy is one of fear, unanswered questions, and a lingering sense of injustice. The unsolved murders serve as a stark reminder of the fragility of life and the enduring impact of violent crime on communities. The victims, whose lives were tragically cut short, continue to deserve justice, and their families remain steadfast in their hope that one day the truth will emerge and the freeway phantom's identity will be revealed.